Good morning and welcome to Children's Church here at St. Philip Lutheran Church in Myrtle Beach, South Carolina. I'm Pastor Jason and again, welcome to uh, Children's Church here with us. We're going to start off by lighting a candle like we always do. And let's have a prayer. The Lord be with you. Let us pray. Dear God, we thank you for bringing us together today. Be with us as we study your word. Help us to know your love forever and ever. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. So you may notice that we are in a different spot today. We're here in, in my office with lots of books and shelves and papers. Um, but we're here for a reason. It's because I wanted to show you something that, that's in my office that, that is a good reminder for me. And we saw it at the very beginning on my bulletin board on the wall here. But it's this sign. And it's a funny word, isn't it? You might Can you say what that word is? Yeah. So I say it like wiggyot. Wiggyot. Now here's the thing. That's not a real word. It's a made up word. But each letter of the word stands for something else. So wiggyot, when you do that, take the, the letters, it says, where is God in all this? Where is God in all this? Wiggyot. And it helps me because sometimes I don't see God doing anything. I don't know what God is up to. And maybe you feel that way too. It's been a long time since we've been to church together. Since March. March. It's a long time ago. And when we don't come to church and we aren't together and we don't see our friends and we don't hear Bible stories and we don't sing songs and we don't have communion, sometimes we forget about God. And we forget that, that God is still part of our lives, that God is still working and still doing things. And it's important to, to look for what God is up to because God is always with us. God is creating things just like God did a long time ago. God listens to our prayers. We talked about that uh, in our series on the Lord's Prayer. God gives us everything that we need. I mean, God is very, very active and involved in our lives. And, and lately, we might have forgotten that. And so what we're going to do over the next few weeks is we're going we're gonna to look for God and what God is up to. We're going to see how God um, gives us things and see what God is up to. And I could really use your help in that. I, I sent an email to, to your parents asking them to, to put up a, a camera, a video, and give you an interview. And in that interview, they're going to ask you questions, some that are easy and some that might be a little hard, but they're going to ask you about where you see God and what God has done. And I want to include some of those videos in our Children's Church videos for the next few weeks. So if you could help me out and, and answer some of those questions, I think we could have some, some really good conversations and see what God is up to in our lives and in our world, even when we can't get together at church. Because God is there. God loves us, and God is giving us uh, everything that we need to live and praise and worship and uh, see God working in our lives. So if you can help me out, we'll answer the question, Wigiat, together. But until next week, go in peace, serve the Lord. Thanks be to God.